One. Salve Maria, everyone. Good evening. We are ready to start our streaming. So we're going to start with the recitation of the Holy Rosary. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to hell. On the third day, He rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, He will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, beloved daughter of God the Father. Hail Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, admirable Mother of God the Son. Hail Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, most faithful spouse of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Immaculate Heart of Mary, have mercy. Pray for us. Our Lady, help of Christians, pray for us. Mystical Rose, pray for us. In the first glorious mystery we contemplate the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ. In this mystery, we ask Mary Most Holy for the grace to always have present in our mind the scene of the resurrection and of the final judgment when everything about everyone will be revealed to all. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and the hour of our death, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Immaculate Heart of Mary, pray for us. Our Lady, help of Christians, pray for us. In the second glorious mystery, we contemplate 
the ascension of our Lord Jesus Christ. In this mystery we ask Mary most holy for the grace of always having an ardent desire of reaching heaven with our glorified bodies. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, Jesus forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Our Lady, help of Christians, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. In the third glorious mystery, we contemplate the descent of the Holy Spirit upon Our Lady and the Apostles. In this mystery, we ask Mary Most Holy to intercede for us before her divine spouse, to obtain for us the plenitude of the gifts that so completely transform the disciples of Jesus so that in this way we may fulfill our mission with perfection. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. 
Our Lady Help of Christians, pray for us. Saint John Bosco, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. In the fourth glorious mystery, we contemplate the Assumption of Our Lady, body and soul, into heaven. In this mystery, we ask Mary Most Holy for an ardent and tender devotion to such a good mother, our Father. Who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Amen. Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Our Lady, refuge of sinners, pray for us. Immaculate Heart of Mary, pray for us. In the fifth glorious mystery, we contemplate the coronation of Our Lady as Queen of Heaven and Earth. In this mystery, we ask Mary Most Holy for her intercession to attain perseverance in grace and the crown of glory. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. O Lady, help of Christians, pray for us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee we cry, poor banished children of Eve, 
to deal with mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Then the most gracious advocate and eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O Clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may go to the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant we beseech thee that, meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. And let's conclude with a litany of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, Lord have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, Christ, Christ Jesus, 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 hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Holy Mother of God, pray for us. Holy Virgin of Virgins, pray for us. Mother of Christ, pray for us. Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother most pure, Pray for us. Mother most chaste. Pray for us. Mother inviolate. Pray for us. Mother undefiled. Pray for us. Mother most amiable. Pray for us. Mother most admirable. Pray for us. Mother of good counsel. Pray for us. Mother of our Creator. Pray for us. Mother of our Savior. Pray for us. Mother of the Church. Pray for us. Virgin most prudent. Pray for us. Virgin most venerable. Pray for us. Virgin most renowned. Pray for us. Virgin most powerful. Pray for us. Virgin most merciful. Pray for us. Virgin most faithful. Pray for us. Mirror of justice. Pray for us. Seat of wisdom. Pray for us. Cause of our joy. Pray for us. Spiritual vessel. Pray for us. Vessel of honor. Pray for us. Singular vessel of devotion. Pray for us. Mystical rose. Pray for us. Tower of David. Pray for us. Tower of ivory. Pray for us. House of gold. Pray for us. Ark of the covenant. Pray for us. Gate of heaven. Pray for us. Morning star. Pray for us. Health of the sick. Pray for us. Refuge of sinners. Pray for us. Comforter of the afflicted. Pray for us. Help of Christians. Pray for us. Queen of angels. Pray for us. Queen of patriarchs. Pray for us. Queen of prophets. Pray for us. Queen of apostles. Pray for us. Queen of martyrs. Pray for us. Queen of confessors. Pray for us. Queen of virgins. Pray for us. Queen of all saints. Pray for us. Queen conceived without original sin. Pray for us. Queen assumed into heaven. Pray for us. Queen of the most holy rosary. Pray for us. Queen of the family. Pray for us. Queen of peace. Pray for us. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, save us, O Lord. Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we be worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Grant unto us, thy servants, we beseech thee, O Lord God, at all times to enjoy health of soul and body, and by the glorious intercession of Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, when freed from the sorrows of this present life, to enter into that joy which has no end. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Immaculate Heart of Mary. Pray for us. O Lady, help of Christians. Pray for us. All holy angels and saints. Pray for us. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, as we have uh, some more minutes before the introduction of the Mass, um, it's always nice to, 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 to share something about the Rosary. And today I want you to share something that for many may be basic, but because it is basic, you know, repetition sometimes is a great friend towards perfection, because to perform something regularly with perfection requires a lot of effort. But it could be the opposite, right? Sometimes we repeat things, we say prayers, but we say them like a, almost like a machine, no? And if you pay attention here, in the last prayer of the Rosary, uh, it says, um, meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, so we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. So. The whole rosary, the idea when we pray all these mysteries, when we say all these mysteries and we pronounce exactly what they are about, is that we also need to meditate about them. So we can imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. And there is something very beautiful here uh, about this rosary. This is actually written by Monsignor Jean Cap and the, uh, the founder of the Helots, for those who are not familiar. And he says something about the the descent of the Holy Spirit, no? And then he says, in this mystery we ask Mary Most Holy to intercede for us before her divine spouse. To do what? To obtain for us the plenitude of the gifts that so completely transform the disciples of Jesus, so that in this way we may fulfill our mission with perfection. So, each and every one of us has a vocation. It could be a vocation for the family, a vocation to raise children, a religious vocation, but we all have one. And if there is 
a very important role on the word mission, on the word vocation, is that we need to focalize, we need to focus, we need to pay attention in what it means. And we just cannot run the whole day without thinking on our particular role. Um, knowing our vocation, what does it mean? It doesn't make us special, but make us, makes us think deeply on what God wants from us. Now, when we forget what God wants from us, we start getting in troubles. But much more than that, if we do not know what God wants from us, we need to find out. Because knowing what God wants from us shows us our place here and now. What our life is for. We're here in the planet Earth, let's say. We're here in Canada or somewhere else for those who are watching from afar. There is no by chance that we are there. But we cannot be people who spend all their, their life, their week, their months, their years without even thinking, without daily thinking on, on what God wants from us. And if we, do, we, we need to find that out so that we are going to be placed in the world with a reason. And it's very sad that many people spend their whole life as if their vocation did never exist, as if the, the, the initial intent God has with them never existed. And then as a result they carry a life that's completely aimless, completely empty, because they don't have a goal. And they don't even know what God wants from them. So how are we going to find out our position in the world? And this is not a position to show off, it's a position to serve. So we need to know exactly what God wants us and how he wants us to serve. So I think I already... Oh, we still have three more minutes. There is one more thing I wanted to call your attention to. And this is it. He says, we need to ask for the plenitude of the gifts that so completely transform the disciples of Jesus. We have the apostles before the arrival of the Holy Spirit and after. But before, there were apostles like St. John, who were absolute, absolutely phenomenal. They were fiery. They were always paying attention. They were always with the Lord. And in turn, Jesus loved them. This is the case of St. John. Yes, they were talking about his gospel, correct? Well, St. John was a fiery soul. He is called the, the one with his brother, St. James, no? the sons of thunder because they were very, very fiery, and yet they were incomplete. So we need to find out, we need to ask God to give us those particular graces that are related to our vocation. Those particular graces that are not just for everybody, not just for the common people, for in particular for us. And not because we are great, again, not because we show off, but we need those particular graces that are somehow sized, that are dedicated in relationship to what we are called to do by God. So, let's focus very well our prayers. This is a rosary again. It's a daily rosary, but we cannot fall into that, oh, this is just a rosary and I repeat it. We need to mean what we repeat. We need to mean what we say. And that's very important. So, again, the meaning of the prayer. Um, a God whose only begotten Son, by His life, death and resurrection, so important, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. So let's really mean it. Let's imitate what they contain so we can obtain what they promise. And at the same time, let's pay attention that those rewards of eternal life are within reach of you and I. But we need to be serious. So when we pray, we need to focus. Anyway, I'll let you rest a little bit before the Mass. We're going to start with a, with a video right now. And we hope to see you later. Salve Maria.
Sub tuum presidium confugimus, Salta Dei Genitrix, Nostras deprecaciones, Ne despiciasi necessitatibus. Sera pedibulis suntis, Libera nos sempre, In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with, with your spirit. spirit. We're going to see today in the liturgy two different types of men. One of them that have a favor, something like the, the fire in the heart, what's the apostle? And the others they could compare with the lukewarm people. You know, I'm going to see if, if each one of us analyze how are we in the the grace and the desire to do apostolate but uh, with fire. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God and, and to you, are my brothers and sisters, and sisters that I have greatly sinned, sinned in my, my thoughts, in, in my words, in what I have done, and what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask the blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. For you alone are the Holy One, you alone are the Lord, 
you alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who gladden us year by year with the solemnity of the Lord's resurrection, graciously granted that by celebrating these present festivities, we may merit through them the rich, to rich eternal joys. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. One day, Peter and John were going up to the temple at the hour of prayer. At three o'clock in the afternoon, and a man lame from birth was being carried in. People would lay him daily at the gate of the temple, called the Beautiful Gate, so that he could ask for alms from those entering the temple. When he saw Peter and John about to go into the temple, he asked them for alms. Peter looked intently at him, as did John, and said, Look at us. And the man fixed his attention on them, expecting to receive something from them. Peter said, I have no silver or gold, but what I have I give you. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, stand up and walk. And he took them by the right hand and raised them up. And immediately his feet and ankles were made strong. Jumping up, the man stood and began to walk. And he entered the temple with them, walking and leaping and praising God. All the people saw him walking and praising God. And they recognized him as the one who used to sit and ask for alms at the beautiful gate of the temple. And they were filled with wonder an amazement at what had happened to him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Let all who seek the Lord rejoice. Let all who seek the Lord rejoice. All give thanks to the Lord, call up in his name. Make known his deeds among the peoples. Sing to him, sing praises to him, tell of all his wonderful works. Let all who seek the Lord rejoice. Glory in his holy name. Let the hearts of those who seek the Lord rejoice. Seek the Lord in his strength. Seek his presence continually. Let all who seek the Lord rejoice. O offspring of his servant Abraham, children of Jacob, his chosen ones, he is the Lord our God. His judgments are in all the earth. Let all who seek the Lord rejoice. He is mindful of his covenant forever of the word that he commanded for a thousand generations, the covenant that he made with Abraham, his sworn promise to Isaac. Let all who seek the Lord rejoice. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia. Let us rejoice and be glad. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. On the first day of the week, Two of the disciples were going to a village called Emos, about 11 kilometers from Jerusalem, and talking with each other about all the things that had happened, that had happened, while they were talking and discussing, Jesus himself came near and went with them. 
but their eyes were kept from recognizing him. And Jesus said to them, What are you discussing uh, with each other while you, you walk along? They stood still, looking sad. Then one of them, whose name was Cleopas, answered him, Are you the only stranger in Jerusalem who does not know the things that have taken place there in these days? Jesus asked them, What things? They replied, The things about Jesus of Nazareth, who was a prophet mighty in deed and word before God and all the people, and how our chief priests and the leaders handed him over to be condemned to death and crucified him. But we had hoped that he was the but we had hoped that he was the one to redeem Israel. Yes, and beside, besides all this, it is now the third day since these things took place. Moreover, some women of our group astounded us. They were at the tomb early this morning, and when they did not find his body there, they came back and told us that they had indeed seen a vision of angels who said that he was alive. Some of those who were with us went to the tomb and found it just as the women had said, but they did not see him. Then Jesus said to them, Oh, how foolish you are, and how slow of heart to believe all that the prophets have declared. Was it not necessary that the Messiah should suffer the things and then enter into his glory? Then, beginning with Moses and all the prophets, he interpreted to them the things about himself in all the scriptures. As they came near the village to which they were going, he walked ahead and if, as if he were going out. But they urged him strongly, saying, Stay with us, because it's almost evening, and the day is now nearly over. So he went in to stay with them. When he was at the table with them, he took bread, blessed, blessed and broke it, and gave it to them. Then their eyes were opened, and they, they recognized Jesus as he vanished from their sight. The two disciples said to each other, Were not our hearts burning within us while he was talking to us on the road, while he was opening the scriptures to us? That same hour they got up and returned to Jerusalem. And they found the eleven and their companions gathered together. This was saying, The Lord has risen indeed, and he has appeared to Simon. Then the two disciples told what had happened on the road, and how the Lord had been made known to them in the breaking of the bread. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to the Lord Jesus Christ. Ave Maria, graça plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunca e na hora mortis nostre, amém. As uh, we said, at the, at the beginning of the Mass. In today's liturgy, we can consider two types of men. On one hand, we see the disciples of Emmaus returning from Jerusalem. At that time, they didn't have, rec have received the Holy Spirit. They were now they completely discouraging, probably, 
And the uh, weeping, coming back to his little town. At a certain moment on the road, Jesus approaches them and begins to explain everything that happened. But their hearts do not react. Afterwards, they will see, ah, do you remember how our hearts seem to, to burn? I mean, something they felt, but they didn't react in the presence of our God, of our Lord. How was it possible that standing before Jesus, that they didn't recognize him? They knew him. They stayed with him two years, accompanying our Lord to every place. It's because they were tepid, they were lukewarm. What's lukewarm? What does it mean? A lukewarm person is someone who, in front of the marvels of the faith, is like a an ox, look at the palace. Can you imagine an ox? Could it be an ox, a dog, anything? Look at the palace. This is the look man, no? the look warm. It's the look warm, it's like this. You show him marvels of the faith. Everything grandiose. Look, interesting. They don't react. He says, but he doesn't understand anything. How foolish and how slow of heart to believe you are, claims our Lord. The lukewarm is slow to understand. He's slow to understand because he doesn't want to understand. And because it's lukewarm. He's the one uh, who, for example, seeing a beautiful ceremony of Easter, Trillium, the heart doesn't burn. It doesn't move. Oh, it's a ceremony. Mm, oh, that's, it's nice. It's nice. The only thing is able to say, it's nice. But you can see the fire in his heart. The lukewarm is the one whom you give a mission to. He always finds an excuse not to complete it. The lukewarm is always complaining. Have you ever seen people like this? Yes. But warm, or is complaining, doesn't do what it has to do. Our Lord said he came to bring fire to burn the earth. The lukewarm doesn't even burn a match. He's lukewarm, he doesn't have fire you know, in his heart. And I remember attending a lecture by Professor, Plin Professor Plinio Correa de Oliveira. And in that lecture, he imagined uh, God at that judgment of a lukewarm man. And he imagined our Lord saying to him, In your life, you gave 50%. Probably you gave 70%. You gave it 90%. But it was the 100 which I was expecting to you, from you. Our Lord wants us that we give 100%. In that Look warm, doesn't give a hundred percent because he's complaining everything. He doesn't 
do what you want to, to, to do. It's like a wax. Look at the palace. We can found, I mean, we can uh, make the reign of Mary with lucker, luck, luck warm persons. The opposite is St. Peter entering the temple. When that poor man asked alms to them, he said, I have neither gold nor silver, but what I have, I give you. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Nazarene, get up, stand up, and walk. This is a man who had a heart of fire. Because she should have a heart of fire to, this, to do this miracle. Because only men who have fire in the heart can convert, perform miracles. And so we have different type of men. One, the disciples, at that time, they convert afterwards, of course. But at that time, they were like a worm. So, in, they didn't... Uh, care with anything. The other, other side, we see St. Peter. And our, in our, in our, nowadays, I know a man of fire. It's Monsignor Jean-Claude. I know him. A tireless fighter. Never complaining of anything. And placing all of his trust in Our Lady, every time. And following the footsteps of Professor Plinio Corrido de Oliveira, he had accomplished a work that only men of fire can accomplish, the herald of the gospel. But each man, you, myself, each one of us, if we, or if it, he is not lukewarm one, is also capable to accomplishing great works. He, you were called to be a, a, a man of fire. And God wants you to be a man of fire, a woman of fire, each one of us. And we can't get there. Do you know how? We have Our Lady here, that's one that wants to hear your prayer. And may our lady make us also men of fire. Let's ask, let's put this intention in this mass. If we have a heart of fire, we will set the earth on fire. May God bless you.
Dear brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice in your eyes may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice of your hands for the praise and the glory of His name, for the good of all of the Holy Church. Receive, we pray, O Lord, the sacrifice which has redeemed the human race, and be pleased to accomplish in us salvation of mind and body, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift up the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation. And all times to acclaim you, O Lord. But in this time, above all, to love you yet more gloriously when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed. For he is the true Lamb who has taken away the sins of the world. By dying, he's, he has destroyed our death, and by rising, restored our life. Therefore, overcome with Pascal joy, every land, every people exult is in our praise, and even the heavenly powers with the angel hosts thing, sing together the unending hymn of your glory as they acclaim. Sanctus, 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 Dominus Deus Sabaoth, Plenis ut ceri et eram, Gloria Tua, Hosanna in excelsis, Benedictus qui venit, in omine domini, Osana in excelsis. You are indeed the Holy Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make you holy, therefore. By sending down our spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, 
for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in the memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, and Thomas, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Remember then into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you through all the ages, we may merit to be called heirs to eternal life and may praise you and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. At the Savior's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, but that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Agnus Dei, qui tolis peccata mundi, misere nobis. Agnus Dei, qui tolis peccata mundi, misere Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those who call to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
the disciples recognized the Lord Jesus in the breaking of the bread. Alleluia.
Anima Christi sanctificame. Corpus Christi salvame. Sanguis Christi inebriame. Agonatelis Christi lavame. Passio Christi conforetame. O Bone Jesu, exaudime. In etra tua vulnerabs conedeme. Ne permitas me separari a te. A vos te maligno defendeme. In ora mortis me vocame. Et iube me venire ad te. Ut cum santis tuis laudem te. In secula secula. said, I'm a merciful and a gracious God, slow to anger and rich in kindness and fidelity. Continue his kindness for a thousand generations and forgiven wickedness and crime and sin. Do come along in our company, yet pardon our wickedness and sins, and receive us as your own. Mary, the star of heaven, who nourished the Lord, has rooted all the plague of death with the first parents of man planted. May that very start now deign to restrain the constellations whose warfare strikes the people with the ulcer of a terrible death. O glorious star of, sea, of the sea, save us from the plague. Hear us, for your Son honors you, refusing you nothing. Save us, Jesus, for whom the Virgin Ma Mother beseeches you. Let us pray. We pray, O Lord, that the reverent reception of the sacrament of your Son may cleanse us from our old ways and transform us into a new creation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Alto spiritual communion, my Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there, and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Pange lingua gloriosi.
Pascalibus at siasti, tua facia spietate concordes, per Christum Dominum nostrum. Amen. Benedictus Deus, Benedicto Nomen Santo Meio, Benedictus Jesus Christus, Verus Deus et Verus Homo, Benedictum Nomen Jesus, Benedictum Coreus Sacratissimo, Benedictus Eius, Preciosissimus Anemui, Benedictus Jesus, in sanctissimo letari sacramento, Benedictus, Spiritus Sanctus Paracleto, Benedicta Magna Mater Dei, Maria Santissima, Benedicta Sancta Eius, ed Immaculata Concessio, Benedicta Eius, Gloriosa Assumpsio, Benedictum Nomen Mariae, Virginis et Matri, Benedictus Sanctus Iosef, Eius Castissimus Pausus, Benedictus Deus in Angelis Suis, et in Sanctis Suis, Fiat our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Lord. Glory to the Father, and, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without the end. Amen. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. O Fiat Fiat, Rex Celestis, Rex Gloria, Mori de su Rex Alleluia. Et mane prima sabati, Ad hostium volum en di, Acerserum discipulis. Alleluia. 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 Regina Celli, Zedane, Alleluia, qui acque gregorissi portare, Alleluia, resurrexit singulixit, Alleluia, ora pro nobis Deus. Thank you very much for watching today. This is our, this is all for it, uh, for, the, for, for this evening. Keep us in your prayers and also don't forget to keep sharing and also to keep sending everybody you can the link to the Mass for their spiritual benefit and ours too. Salve Maria, good night.